Hello friends, this is Jasu Bakuhatsu, and welcome back to Let's Play Azure Dreams. Um, yeah, you might notice we're not on, like, the me the title menu like we usually are when I go into my little intro like that, whenever I do a new play session. I don't know why I even bother, it's not like, it's like what we get one of those, hi, welcome back, like every, what, four, three, three, four, five videos or something. What are these eggs? I don't even remember. But yeah, basically, we, we're like right on the tail of that last play session, and I'm that last uh, another failed tower run and i am like super duper pissed about it so uh and yeah that's kind of i guess suppose that's kind of a recipe for more further disaster i guess oh wow he's still level 22 we didn't even gain that level for nyoko last run like yeah we literally got nothing that was a complete the last like well it's gonna be end up being like yeah four fucking videos complete waste of time garbage and that just pisses me off so it's like normally i like don't play this much every day like i'll, I'll do like one video I think one other time I might have done like two recordings in, or two play sessions, yeah, t two video recordings in like one one sitting. But uh, yeah, I'm just so unhappy with the way the previous one did that I just like yeah decided to fire up uh, to split the video to make sure there's like no technical problems or anything. And then uh, so yeah, what do we got this time? Nothing, jack shit. That's what we got. So uh, that's a problem. And so what we're gonna do, we, yeah, we can't, can't even rely on, uh, on item, on, like, building up a new sword and shield or anything. Like, that's gonna take so much time, take so much, like, grinding and farming and either, like, tons of grinding and farming, which would be the faster way, the fastest way, just do a bunch of barong feeding to get a uh, new sword and shield, the fastest way to do it. But, uh, even then, that would just be, like, a bunch of boring videos, bunch, yeah, a bunch of, yeah, not, not, it would be, like, it, it would be, like, like many many of that shitty extra video and just like basically for like most of the rest of the lp would just be like shitty extra style videos where we just do barong feeding to try to get our freaking uh try, try to get a freaking sword and shield and then uh the sands to buff them up so it's uh can't, can't even rely on that shit at this point anymore so what we're gonna do instead is we're just gonna do our best because yeah typically i like i said typically i don't rely on uh, like having a big super super buff sword and shield to get uh, through the game like this like it, it's not necessary if you got strong familiars they uh, they, can, they can carry you through to the end of the game so that's what we're gonna do like I said we're gonna we're gonna play smarter we're and again we're gonna make we're gonna be making progress from now on so yeah if, I swear to God this time I mean it this time I really really freaking mean it as soon as anything starts to go wrong and we're out of you know problem-solving items in the inventory, J just fucking leave, just fucking cut our losses, get out, sell some items for money, and then that's that's just it. No need to, you know, waste. Like, oh god, how much, how much freaking money have I freaking lost out of, like, all these last several play sessions? It's like, or the last two failed runs, it's just insane. I, ugh, cannot, I cannot, I cannot allow it, that can't happen anymore. Although it's almost, or I really, literally would have lost nothing there, though, if that, that happened. So, Golf Wand, I believe... Do we just get, like, less of a bonus? I'm sure I've asked this question before. It's like, do we get less of a bonus for Mixture Magic with this thing? It doesn't even matter. I'm not even using Mixture Magic at this point. We're just... So basically, we're just, just kind of having them out to have them out, basically. Why are they fighting each other? It sounded like something just killed something. Oh no, so he, ju he just stepped on a trap. Okay. Good job. You just disabled a trap for us, little troll buddy. And so yeah, basically the pro point of this run is, uh, yeah, we're basically, basically going to be diving, essentially. Only, it's like, yeah, it, it feels like the more you wander around, that's just like asking for trouble with your familiars. Especially on the bloom floor. I, I definitely, definitely learned from the last run, don't fuck around on the bloom floor. Especially if, like, you're not using uh, Kuhn as your, uh, as one of your main familiars. Because, yeah, brainwash is what did us in last time. And that's, like, that's a very obvious thing to go wrong. It's like, yeah, brainwash and then you're super high level. I I've talked about that, and I think I talked about that the first time we saw, like, brainwash as a thing. It's like the first time it happened, I said, that can be a really bad thing once you get some high level familiars and your run can end right there. And that's basically what happened last time. Everything went to shit. As soon as Nioko betrayed us, he got like what f fucking seduced by a flower. What, what kind of pervert? It's like I don't even know. Uh, 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut the fuck up, dude. How, uh, I'm, I'm curious to see the score after this. It's got to be at least 12 after this round. Pfft, yeah, good choice of targets there, buddy. I think you just pissed him off. Okay, it's got, like, what, nine wins? Okay, we're gonna get that up to 12, probably, by the time this... Oh, hey, we got a Wind Crystal. Very nice. Okay, Medicinal Herb. And run, run, run. All the way to the exit. And I think we're just we're just, we're just gonna dive down the exits. Or I guess... I guess there's nothing super threatening on the lower floors, so mainly I think what we want to do is we want to get ourselves a sword and shield. Mainly a shield. Not even a good one, not even like new gold sword, new mirror shield or something to buff up. No, just like any regular sword, any regular shield. Because that was the biggest problem, and and don't even fucking equip it if it's a leather shield. Because if that shit is cursed, it just ruins your run. If we'd have had a shield, we could have... Like, um, pretty much any shield, like any halfway decent shield, would have saved us that run. We'd have gotten just enough to def defense to uh, survive those two hits, and we'd have been fine. But because I was on zero defense... Um, yeah, we just got fucked by lizard men in two hits. And that's what happens when you've got a cursed leather shield and no way to get rid of it. I got such bad luck on the, uh, on the scrolls and stuff, too. Didn't get the decurse scroll, didn't get the restore scroll. It's just like, oh, nothing but garbage. Oh, we had so much freaking bad luck on that run. It was ridiculous. Ah. Oh. Okay, this run, it's like, apparently hoping didn't help, so whatever. Forget hoping. Hoping was a failed strategy. I don't even, I don't even fucking care what we get on this run. Just, just get, get some progress and survive. I guess that's the one thing. It's like, yeah, so I'm so happy that we made it to such a high floor on the last run. We didn't make it fucking anywhere last run. We just died. It's like, when you, when you die in Atter Dreams, it's like, it doesn't matter if you die on floor 30... You die on floor 39, it's just the same as if you died on floor 1. I guess it's not entirely true, you get experience for your familiar buddies, I guess, so I guess that's something. But like I said, we didn't even get like a full level for Nyoko, so yeah, that was just a shit run. Garbage. Unacceptable. Okay, spell balls, poison ball. Again with the fucking poison balls, that's just... Oh, you can if you can't tell how angry I am at this point. I have to restrain myself by saying how fucking angry I am. But come on, Yoko, get in there. Get your fucking shit together. Part, part of it is the anger, part of it is also the alcohol. Apparently I start swearing a lot once I start drinking more. I don't even notice it. I, I actually never even noticed it until I had it pointed out to me by my parents. Uh, but, uh, and it's like, yeah, I guess you're right. <laughs> when they when they did point it out, it's like, I have been swearing a bit more, haven't I? But, uh, I don't know, it's just not so something I even notice most of the time. I, I guess I caught it there, so maybe that's not true. Maybe that bit of, what does anorexia do? Yeah, it's, I think it's attack down or something. Maybe, no, no, it prevents them from eating, that's right. They won't eat food. Okay. Oh yeah, we lost an egg last time too, or no, it was a Minova egg, who gives a shit? Uh, speaking of Minovas, those can't possibly be in Minovas, but, you know, they're kind of... I don't know, two items like sit of the same type sitting there together next to each other, it just always makes me suspicious, even on floors where Minovas can't exist. Uh, I think the thing that pisses me off the most about the frog is not just... is, is mainly just that it slows down your movement so much, it's like you just like hop hop hop, so much so much slower than step step step. Okay. In my anger, I kind of don't really have too much to talk about except how angry I am. am. You know what? In fact, yeah, since we're not even gonna bother uh, going for like a new sword to build up, I think I'm just gonna put red sands on like this sword. For this run. Like, the sands from now on are just for whatever sword we happen to be using. Oh, hey, there's the exit. How, do, how good is this sword, anyways? Halfway decent. Not compared to our familiar, of course, but whatever. Olim fruit. Halfway decent. Gulf wand. That's actually good for our, uh, yeah, for win there, and that'll go really well with his mix mixture magic, which will be our main source of damage on the upper floors, which we will, we will definitely be making it to the upper floors this time. 
Actually, no, I'm not even gonna say that. Not even definitely gonna make it to the upper floors, but we are definitely going to escape alive, regardless of where we make it. Even if we, like, come out with, like, an empty inventory, if, like, we, like, we leave right now, and, like, with the items we have, and that's just what we gotta do, if that's what we gotta do. And actually, I bet you that Nyoko's, yeah, getting kind of low on the MP, so, uh, chow down on this. Actually, actually, considering that this is, I kind of want to do a progress run here. Might not be a bad idea to stock up on herbs and uh, pitas, in, or pitas you want to stock up on anyways on the inventory. Like I said, pita is like your main, it's like the main thing you want to collect in a progress run. Just to make sure that you can make good use of your familiars and get them back once they run out of the MPs, but... Uh, and also the grasses, if you're using a, uh, uh, a Neokobo as your familiar. Ooh, speaking of pitas, except that's a brainwash guy. Uh... Yeah, let's just get the fuck out of here. Or, you know, get the fuck away, at least, just in case something goes down. Okay, good. Double good. Okay. And get the... Probably not even a pita. Oh, it is a pita. Fantastic. And we got we got good balls this time, too. Two blaze balls. That's uh, really good. So, trap. Might as well use that. Never know what... Really, traps are almost as bad on, like, no matter what floor you encounter them. I guess that's not entirely true. The stronger the monsters, the worse some of the immobilizing traps can be. But, uh, whatever. Don't want to rust our vital sword. Heaven for, heavens for Fend. For Fend? I don't know how to pronounce that word. I, I find that a lot. Do you guys... It's Any of you avid readers out there who aren't necessarily avid... I don't know, speakers? I, I, like, I find that I know a lot of words that I don't actually know how to pronounce because I never used them in a conversation. Like, oh, what was the one... I can't remember. Or it's like, yeah, 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 like, for years and years and years, I didn't actually know how to pronounce the word, uh, mortgage. I always... Okay, that was close. Uh, yeah, mortgage. I always I always thought that it was, like, a mortgage. But, yeah, it's, I, I just hadn't heard the word used, like, out loud before. Until, like, probably a few years ago it was, and it was just... I don't know. And that, that, that was the big one, I remember, because my parents, there was, yeah, my parents thought it was, like, really, really weird that I didn't know how to pronounce Mortgage. <laughs> but, uh, and it, it actually made, uh, what's it, uh, home, th that, uh, Homestar Runner cartoon, uh, Senor Mortgage, a lot funnier, because I didn't even realize, again, until, like, a few years ago that he was actually pronouncing the word incorrectly, so... Yeah, and that happens to me with like a bunch of words. That's the main Mort Gage is the one I can, I mainly remember at the moment. But I'm there's a lot of others. Oh wow, jackpot potentially. I guess it depends on. Okay, so... <laughs> okay, whatever. Uh, so I'll sit it out in the hallway and okay, fire sword. No thanks. Couple coins, couple coins, star glass, might as well. Okay, good, so now we know what everything, um, again, what the backup, or Mahel. Not terribly useful, actually. Um, okay, and, and again, so with, when this happens, you back off and you just run away from him. So that way, if, if they catch up and you end up having to fight him, at least you're a good distance away. In case something terrible happens, wands don't even care about him. Just run away. Manova became blind. He can just continue being blind. Get, get the frick over here. I don't want you chasing Manovas. I want you. You're my frickin' bodyguard. Okay. Gosh, I'm sorry. This was uh, doing this <laughs> two consecutive uh, play sessions. Really, really bad idea. My throat's starting to get like really dry now, which means I got to drink like a lot in order to continue speaking like this at such great length and volume. I'm really, really not used to, like, speaking this much, like, continuously 
for like such a great length of time. Like my throat gets like usually like really, really sore by the time I'm done like any kind of LP session. Sometimes it'll actually continue through to the next day. So it's like sometimes like I, or at least it used to be. And I, I really think it is just like a not me not being used to it because I find that like the more I do it, the less it happens. But it's like, if like, like, like I am this time, if I like, it's been, it's been like a long time since I've done regular LP recording sessions. So I found like when I was kind of just getting back into the LP thing recently, I found like, yeah, I, I do like one big long recording session and then like my throat would be so sore even into the next day that I just couldn't do another recording <laughs> the next day. I, I, I had to rest my vocal cords. I don't know if, or maybe if it's just like a knowledge thing and I just don't know how to speak properly. And it's, it's like, you know, like with, uh, like with any muscle, I guess, if you like, if you exercise it wrong, then, uh, yeah, you can like strain it or something. That, that, it's, which is just kind of a funny thing to think about, where it's just like, I, I talk, I speak so little in my, like, day-to-day -day life. Like, I, I mean, sure, I have nothing better to talk about, so might as well get personal. I, li I live, like, an exceptionally like, hermetic existence, bordering on, like, hik hikikomori-ish, kind of. Apart. I guess I got my, kind of my regular board game groups, so that's, like, the one thing. A couple times a week I get out with a couple different uh, groups of people for uh, board games, and I guess that's kind of what keeps me from, like, going full hikikomori, but other than that, I really don't get out of the house and, like, speak to people in any sort of, like, social context whatsoever. And, and even when I do, like, get together with, like, people in it for any, for whatever reason, I don't really converse a lot. So it's like, I, I have exceptionally little contact with, like, other people is basically what I'm getting at, to the point where I, I would, it would not surprise me if I, like, literally don't know how to speak properly and I'm, like, I don't know, improperly using my vocal cords or my diaphragm or something to the, and that's maybe the reason why speaking is such a pain for me at uh, this kind of length and again i'm so inexperienced with this sort of amount of speaking that it it's like i it's, that could be the case for all i know or this could just all be like a bunch of nonsense and it's like maybe totally normal for someone to like uh you know someone's throat to get a bit sore after speaking this much it's just like, I don't know, I, I'm bad at human speech, apparently. So yeah, I, I, I don't know, I felt the need to go into that for some reason. Um, and it's, I, I, even, even for my work, actually, I, uh, sure, let's get even more personal. Uh, the work, I actually work from home, I I'm kind of, do kind of like an independent contract work, like a website. Uh, may, or not really website design, mainly programming. Uh, they get other people to do the design, typically, and I do the implementation. Basically, freelance web programming is my job, and I work out of my out of my home, essentially. So yeah, it's, and it's like I don't even. It's like once in a, every once in a while, I'll have like a meeting with like a my like a, yeah one of my clients or my my employer or something, and then that's like the other amount of interaction I get, except after I get the project, I'm like on my own for however long it takes to get that done. So then, so it's like, yeah, I don't even have like a, jo a regular job or something to get me out of the house and talking to people. So uh, we don't even have a shield yet to use that goddamn sand on. Although, actually, yeah, so that being the case, let's just use the red sand. And actually, yeah, we can, yeah, we can just like kind of keep this sword from run to run soon because we definitely won't fucking lose it. I, that's that's the definitely like even though we may not necessarily make it super high on this attempt We're sure as fuck not losing our sword Except perhaps to replace it With an even better one although vital is what what five a five strength sword. I don't think they actually do get better than that That's like super specific uh, super specific ability for some reason it's like prevent them from multiplying there is literally one enemy in the entire game that multiplies so i guess we yeah we can deal with those guys really easy but it's kind of crazy like how little i like interact with other people it's like i to the point where like i don't know how like other people it's like i don't know how to describe it it's like all these people it seems that everyone I know, like, knows all these people and has, like, all these friends, and it's just, I don't even know, like, 
Where do you find these people? What do, what are you doing in your free time that you're like actually encountering people somewhere? <laughs> it's like I don't even know. I just think that's funny. I'm not complaining or anything. I'm actually I'm actually extremely happy actually with kind of where my life is at right now. I have so much free time. I'm like fairly financially secure, although coincidentally, that's not really the case right now. I've just been kind of a slow kind of slow on the work front for like the last couple months or so, which was almost kind of bordering on troubling, but uh other than that though, I've been like I think it's been going really well for me, I think, uh, the last... It's about the last year or so. Yeah, I've been really happy. Ah, uh, get it. Been getting colds, more likely. Come on. Or, uh, more often than I like. It seems, it's, it seems that, like, I don't know. It's, it seems like every month or something, I'll, like, have a cold for a week for some reason, and I don't know why. I don't know. And again, like, medicine and health is not really a thing. Uh, another area that kind of, I'm kind of inexperienced with. I don't typically see doctors. I just, I don't know, tough it out. Apparently that's a guy thing. Like, not even, like, not even just, like, you know, socio-culturally or whatever, but just, like, an actual statistic. It's just guys don't like going to see doctors about shit. They'd rather just tough it out. And I don't, I don't know, I don't, it's like, maybe it's social conditioning? I don't feel like I've been, like, socially conditioned. Like, I'm not... Like, I'm not, I'm not, like, concerned about, like, what people will think of me if I'm, like, go see a doctor or anything. It's just, it doesn't, it doesn't concern me. So I just, so I just don't go. It's, I just figure it's, it'll clear up on its own, I'm sure. And if it doesn't, then I'll go a, see a doctor, but it, it always does, so... Well, I'm, I'm, I'm getting into, like, way... I mean, at this point, I might as well just go into the frickin' PlayStation... Play, uh, P yeah, PlayStation topics I have on the list to at least keep things kind of grounded and kind of related to... You know, kind of... I'd imagine what your guys' interests are. Like, I, I'd, I'd imagine that, yeah, you guys are here to listen to... What are you guys here to listen to? I'm... I'm baff... <laughs> I, I don't know. I, I'm kind of surprised. And, it, and extremely flattered when I get, like, positive comments on my videos, and it's, yeah, I think it's really cool that, uh, that, yeah, see, like, I, I don't respond to comments online enough, just because a lot of the time I don't really know what to say. I'm not usually one for small talk, unless there's, like, a specific, like, inquiry or question that somebody has. I don't typically feel the need to respond, to really interact with people online whatsoever, but it's just... So I guess, yeah, I'll just sort of do that now for anyone who's made it this far into the LP. I, I, I really do appreciate the uh, positive comments. It, like, really... It kind of baffles me. Like, I don't really understand what the appeal is here. But uh, nevertheless, I, uh, I, I really like uh, hearing that kind of stuff. And it always it's, it's always a really pleasant surprise to uh, sort of encounter someone who actually kind of... Who, who has, like, any... Who gets any kind of enjoyment from the uh, content I put out. So, uh, yeah, thanks a lot uh, for, you know, all the people who do that. And, and actually, even the people who don't comment, I think I've, got, I've gone into this kind of tangent before, but it's like, like I said, I can see, I can see the stats. I, I know how many people, like, watch these videos and, like, follow the series and watch to the end. Or watch, like, a good portion. So it's like, yeah, even, even people who don't comment, like, I, I, I can see that you're watching, and that also, uh, yeah, I, I just really appreciate that, so, uh, Normally, I guess people save the kind of talk to, like, the end of the video or whatever, but I guess I'm just going to throw it in, like, right here in the middle of one. Uh, yeah. Uh, thank you for your support. 